Hello. My name is Jeff. So, it is less than 24 hours before the end of the Monster Hunter event, as well as the Gacha Banner. In my opinion, I recommend all of you to spend all of your Wimites to pull as much as you can, until you get all of the Hunter Adventurers and the Monsters as well. After all, the Hunter Adventurers has its own unique playstyle that somewhat resembles the core mechanics of Monster Hunter, so it's definitely worth giving a shot if you want to try them out now. Like I said in the previous video, this collab event may not reoccur again in the future, since the Fire Emblem Heroes collab hasn't reappeared since last year. Another reason I can give you, is because all of the existing adventurers, including those that are limited, will arrive in either revival events or during a festive season. Just like the Zodiac units during New Year, the Dragonul during Christmas, Halloween, and even the ongoing Valentine units as well. You don't have to follow what I say, but this is my advice I'm giving to you right now before the end of this Monster Hunter event. If you do enjoy this type of content, then please, do drop a like in this video, and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. So without further ado, let's see if I can get myself, a Hunter Ceris. I managed to salvage as much Wimites as possible, from Mercurial Gauntlet, and the very hard difficulty missions. I also spent a bit of money on Demantium to do daily deal summon to try and raise the drop rate, and, bought just enough for one tenfold pool as well. Wish me luck.
Nope. It was at this moment that he knew. What the f Thanks, boy.